All right, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Urrutia here, and we're going to go over unit one, lesson one, practice problem number one. Here is a figure that looks like the letter A, along with several other, other figures. Which figures are scaled copies of the original A? Explain how you know. Okay, so here we have the original figure, and we're going to look at the other ones and see if it's a scaled copy. Remember what we learned today about scaled copies? Scaled copies are figures that are either bigger or smaller. You multiply all the sides by the same factor, and they have certain properties that we saw today in today's lesson. And we saw them in the lesson summary. Okay, so if you look here at the original one, it is in a letter A, and it fits inside a square, right? A two by two square. So now let's look at the other figures. So now if you look at figure one, you see how figure one looks a little bit more tall. It's elongated height-wise, so it's not a scaled copy. The width stays the same, but the height is different, so that means it's not a scaled copy. Let's look at figure number two. Figure number two is also within a square, right? And now it's a four by four square. So this one is a scaled copy. So notice how the figure looks the same, but it's bigger compared to the letter figure one, where it's just taller. Okay, figure number three is not a scaled copy. You see how figure number three is leaning back that way? So that means that it's not a scaled copy. That's what changed here. It changed the shape. It looks different. And now figure number four is a scaled copy. And figure number four is a smaller version of figure, the original figure. It is a scaled copy of a fraction. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen.